You can get a free tablet and free data plan if you have EBT benefits. We found two companies offering completely free tablets to EBT users. So let's talk about who is eligible and what you need to do to claim yours. Before we get into the details, you need to know that these tablets are being offered through the Affordable Connectivity Program. If you get EBT, you're automatically eligible for the ACP. This is the same program that can get you free cell phone service with free phones, and it's something we've talked about a lot in other videos. Anyway, according to the FCC, this program can also provide a one-time $100 discount to help you purchase a laptop, desktop, computer, or a tablet from a participating provider, but usually you're required to pay between $10 and $50 for that device. There are a ton of providers out there that will gladly sell you a tablet for $10 and a penny under the ACP, but we have found two providers that will actually give you those tablets for free and make the data plan free as well. But there are some things that you need to know before you sign up. So first, let's talk about Moolah Wireless. Moolah's tablet is comparable with a Samsung A8 tablet. It has a 10 inch screen, a 32 gig capacity, an eight megapixel camera with image stabilization and four times zoom. You'll get the tablet and charger for free if you order it from Moolah Wireless, but there's a weird little catch. You might like it, you might hate it, but it's definitely something you need to know before you order that tablet. The reason Moolah Wireless offers this device to you for free is because they've partnered with another company that will make money when you use it. See, you will be required to opt in to the third party Moolah mobile service in order to get that tablet. Now this service <laughs> makes money in a few ways and some of them may be harmful to you. So before you claim it, I want you to know what you're getting into. First, Moolah will get paid if they pre-install apps on your tablet because the developer will pay them to do so. Now, depending on the developer and the nature of the app, these pre-installed apps may be able to eat up your data with background usage, gather data without your knowledge, or cause other issues with your device. Second, they also may be able to gather data to show you personalized advertisements. It looks like these ads may be able to show on your home and lock screens as well, which is more intrusive than typical mobile ads. You'll have to read their terms and conditions as well as their privacy policy to be sure about what data they gather, how it is used, and what you can do about it. Now the good news is that it looks like Moolah Mobile will actually pay you to look at those ads. You'll accrue points that get saved up in your wallet, which you can then use to purchase gift cards, extra data, upgraded services, and more. If you like earning points and redeeming gift cards, you may think this is a great deal. I'm pretty cautious with my data, so I don't think it's something I would do personally, but it's something that you might be interested in. So that's why I kept looking for other options as well. And that brings us to Cathect Communications. Cathect also offers a free tablet under their ACP program. Their tablet is a little smaller. It has an eight inch display and a 32 gig capacity. The camera is still an eight megapixel, but it looks like the image stabilization and zoom features that Moolah has are not offered by Cathect. They also don't explain how they cover the $10 fee required by the ACP. I interacted with an online chat support representative named Ed who couldn't explain it. He did say that Cathect does not pre-install any software software or require to use any specific apps on the device, which means that they probably aren't using an intrusive third-party software like Moolah Mobile, but it leaves a lot of questions unanswered. The tablet also has some other downsides. Ed said that the program includes 20 gigs of data, and when I asked about if that was monthly or how you get more data, he said that you would have to reach out to the company to refresh it, but that the data would be free. You just have to reach out to them over chat or by calling the customer service number to get that refreshed. And he said it can take between two and 24 hours to get more data loaded onto your device, which could result in frequent interruptions of service. That's something you'll want to know before you get into it, because you can only claim one of these tablets one time ever. So if you choose one company and then decide you'd rather another, you're kind of stuck. Anyway, I realize this isn't exactly encouraging, but I always wanna make sure that you know exactly what you're getting into before you go through the process of signing up for these programs. After all, if you don't wanna deal with the extra advertising or the burdensome data refreshes, then any ACP provider can hook you up with a tablet for around 10 bucks. It's not quite free, but it may be a better or more reliable deal in the long run than choosing one of these freebies. And of course, if you don't like any of these options, then jump over and check out our video about how to get 
free computers because we found many different charitable organizations that can help you get a free computer, laptop, tablet, even if you don't get EBT. So click on over to that video and I'll see you there.